In this video, I'm going to show you how you can check and change the lighting groups. In our example here, we have a lighting device output with two outputs, means two lighting groups. One is the lighting output one, uh, assigned to group number one, and the other one is the lighting output number three, assigned to lighting group three. In addition to that, we see here two lighting application functions. For, so for every group, we have one application function and the number of these groups is lighting group one and lighting group two. If we have now a look into the lighting output number one and we click on the line, we change here in the properties areas to the object use tab. We see the lighting output is connected to the lighting group number one. So this lighting output is properly connected to a lighting group and a lighting application function. When we change now to the lighting command number three, so the output of uh, that lighting group here, then we see there is no connection to any lighting application function. So this um, viewer here gives you a good overview about, okay, what is connected and what's not. If we have a look now also in the lighting application functions, we see here the same picture in the lighting application function number one, we have directly connected also here the lighting output number one, so that these things of group one, the AEF, the application function and the output are properly connected. If we have a look now on the lighting application function number two, we see we miss here the output. And so this is consistent with the, with the picture we saw before of the lighting output number three, which is not connected to any AF. Also in the AF, we do not see the output here. So vice versa, we see there is no connection to it. How to change that now? We simply adapt here of the output the number. So we change it to number two. And with that change now, we are connecting that output number two to the lighting output, uh, to the lighting function number two. If we change now here again and open the, uh, the application function, we see now the connection has established. So we see here now in lighting application function number two, there is the output connected automatically. Also here we can change now in the, op in the property tab, also here we see on the lighting output number two, we see the proper connection to lighting functionality and application function number two. So these two uh, views can help you to check the connection and as we learned also here, changing here the extension number of the lighting outputs and lighting application function does reconnect or change the connection of an output to an application function.